popular fast fashion marketplace Shein, which delivers to more than 150 countries, is all set to make a comeback in India. Shein is partnering with Reliance Retail to re-enter the Indian market. Shein is a Chinese e-commerce platform which is headquartered in Singapore. It was very popular in India for its stylish clothing at affordable prices. But in 2020, India banned Xi'an along with 58 other Chinese apps to safeguard national sovereignty and integrity. The government believed that these apps posed risks in terms of data collection, storage and potential misuse. Despite the ban, Xi'an products continued to be available in India through the likes of Amazon. That was until the Delhi High Court issued a notice to ban the sale of Xi'an clothing on the e-commerce platform. But now Reliance Retail is bringing back the popular Chinese fashion brand in India after three years. According to reports, under the partnership, Xi'an will be sourcing fabrics from small Indian businesses. The company also has plans to build a production hub in India for export to the Middle East. If it works, this strategy could set an example for startups grappling with the Chinese backlash. Xi'an has set up operational teams around the world and has also been trying to diversify its supply chain by opening a manufacturing base in Turkey. But Xi'an has its fair share of global troubles. In the US, for instance, a Congress body singled out Xi'an and accused the company of exploiting trade tariff loopholes and violating intellectual property rights. Xi'an has also been sued for copying designs of popular brands such as Levi's, Doc Martens and Ralph Lauren. It has even been accused of using forced labour from the Chinese ethnic minority, the Uyghurs. The company has, however, denied such claims. Xi'an was valued at $100 billion after a funding round in April 2022. It has reportedly posted around $23 billion in sales last year. On the other hand, Reliance Retail grew its net profit by 30% from 7,000 crores at the end of FI22. Isha Ambani was named the new leader of Reliance Retail in August last year.